What's up, G.I. Joe fans? Welcome back to the MIB Master Museum. I'll be your curator today. And guys, we got a fun installment for you today. We got a really fun offering for you today. All the way from 2005, we have the talking G.I. Joe Adventure Team Commander. This was a G.I. Joe Club exclusive. And uh, I was fortunate enough to be a part of the G.I. Joe Club during that time period and purchased this awesome figure. Let's go in, guys. Take a look at it. This was, this figure was created by popular demand of the G.I. Joe collector's community wanting to, to see the adventure team commander recreated, reproduced. And guys, that's what you, that's what we got. Now if you can see that, let's see, let's get his, I'm trying to see if I can get that, get his uh, tag for you. He comes with a, uh, a metal dog tag, and as you can see, the, let's get you the, the 1970 to 2005, 35 years of Adventure Team. He's got his Adventure Team logo, lifelike hair. And here, here's the really cool shorts with the Adventure Team logos on them. And you're probably asking, guys, I know, I know probably what you're, you're going to ask. Where is his clothes at? Well, the cool thing about this, the twist that the G.I. Joe Collectors Club and Hasbro wanted to put on this uh, re, uh, reproduction of the uh, Adventure Team uh, commander, team commander, was they wanted to give him underclothes. They gave him a t-shirt and boxers, really cool <laughs> adventure team boxers. So this was a little spin they wanted to put on him. The original didn't come with this. So what they did was they put all of his accessories and his clothes, his boots, weapons, everything else is in his uh, coffin box here and we'll be letting you see that in a minute let's get in real close on him um, another one of my favorite figures um, I couldn't afford growing up as a kid I couldn't afford any G.I. Joe's they were just too expensive I would have loved to have them but it's too expensive and I love the fact that they put um, they, they're thinking about the collectors here Hasbro they put the batteries to the side so it's your choice if you want to put the install the batteries this is a talking G.I. Joe Adventure Team Commander and this set came out in 2005 um, And I had to uh, do my research because it's been, it's, we have so many Joes. I had to rethink and say, you know, when did I get this guy? You know, and that, that's, I, I'm guys at my old age, you know, I thought we got this guy a little later than that, but that wasn't, not, that wasn't the case. So we did our research and, you know, we got him right around 2005. Sometimes just because of the club exclusives, release these guys um, I, I tend not to get them immediately so it throws my thought process off on what year I got this guy so it was 2005 that I got him and I always I just want to make sure I'm getting the right information out to you guys uh, this figure was released in 2005 And what they did was, the box that you see behind him, 
he came in a just a, a plain white mailing box. But this is, he say MIB. He, you, you, you took him out. He's out. He's out of the box. No, he's <laughs> no, he's he's not out of the box. He's not out of the box. Um, this is a very uh, well crafted plastic um, plastic box, if you will, that they have him encased in, and he's got some type of a plastic shrink wrap over top of that as well. Let's see if we can show you down here the bottom. He's sealed in all the way in. This is from the adventure team uh, figure from the 19 from 1970. So you see the they still had the old hand sculpts from the 1960s. So, but he's not out of his box, guys. <laughs> and speaking of boxes, let's go over and we're gonna try to I'm try to get this. Oh boy, having a here we go. Here we go. Let's bring this up close. Thank you. And this is how he's he came. He had this box. Let's pick the box up. Eh? Let's do let's do one of these numbers right here. Here you go. This is a reproduction of the exact uh, Venture Team uh, Team Commander box, coffin box that he came in. He talks with life life like hair. Just super cool. And it came with a little twist, a little twist here, and on the side it give you, you pull the dog tag and he talks. And here's some other uh, club exclusives that you can get. We have these guys as well. <clears throat> we'll be doing a review on these guys down the down the line. See, adult collectible not intended for use by children this was completely geared for the G.I. Joe collector and not the younger demographic and go inside the box you have all of his instructions here this is what he says and you look at all of his clothes are encased inside of a bag. Let's get you a blown out shot of that. And then there's this pistol. It's in the bag. Excellent. And you can see right here he has the he's got his tag in there. He has a, another logo, another venture team logo. Just a fun set. There's his uh, boots down here at the, the bottom. And it was designed and set up like this uh, for collectors that wanted to or didn't want to take um, this guy out and 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 display him. Or you could keep him just like the way we have him. And like I said, ours is our uh, adventure team commander. Talking adventure team commander is for museum purposes only. Uh, he's of museum quality, C10. So this is how we kept him, um, and he's been like that ever since 2005. We just want to. We wanted to show this guy and just show you this is another cool way of, um, of packaging guys and, and uh, like I said this was done from the, the, the collectors club and Hasbro with the mindset of the collector in mind they wanted the you know they this is definitely set up for 
the collector. Guys, tell me what you think about this guy. We'd we'll love to hear your thoughts and opinions on him. Just a cool figure to me. I'm a bit biased though, so that's what that's why I want you guys' opinion on it. Please uh, leave a comment in the comment section right underneath this video. We would love to hear from you. And so this is just another figure that we have in our museum. We have so many, uh, just a wide variety of figures, um, different sets, different play sets, and we will be unveiling uh, more throughout the day. We're just getting started, guys. Uh, I just had my first cup of coffee. <laughs> so. We're excited about that. So we're really got, we're, we're, we're hitting the ground running today. With some awesome figures. We're going to have some awesome reviews. Coming right at you. Guys, please like and subscribe. It helps the channel. And for our new subscribers, welcome aboard. Welcome to the family. To our old subscribers, thank you for the love and support that we've been getting from you guys. We appreciate it. We appreciate all the comments and all the knowledge that's being shared on our channel uh, regarding G.I. Joe. And with that being said, guys, you know the drill. You know the drill. God bless. And keep collecting.